Back to the Group 1 action now, and it's the Prince of Wild Stakes, a 10 furlong Group 1 for the older horses. A massive field for this. Around this turn as well. This was a could be an interesting one on the round course. At the top, Ozzy Anshan, Dan Hughes, Foreman, David Robertson, Hatch Defender for Munas, Ithaca Circle, Vinnie Gerard, Lambs Bear, Dan Hughes, Monterey Cool. Look at that three wins on the trot for Vinnie Gerard, Pathmaster. Oh, Joshua Sutherland, Purple Morning for Munas, Tallahassee Typhoon, Paul Rhodes, Tower of Good Spies, Jim Murray, Welsh Rabbit, Derek Hinton, Foreign Trade, Leon Van Rensburg, Humid Rarity, Darren Thompson, Missiles Lock, Paul Rhodes, Niggle Harriet, James Shea, Organised State, Leon Van Rensburg, Patterson's Return, James Shea, and Star Class Rima for Derek Hinton. So we're on the round track, and away we go. And some of those drawn wide are going to have to make the decision whether they're going to drop back and cut in or whether they're going to stay wide it looks like pathmaster has got a pretty simple decision and that's take the lead and get the fence hopefully for joshua so then we'll stay there lambs bear is in second you can see them foreign uh, foreign trade and organized state the two leon van rensburg horses they're going to want to try and cut across but i'm not sure they're going to be able to um there's another one up there quite odd jim murray's horse is pretty wide tower of good spies but they're coming around this little bend now then and pathmaster is in the lead leading by about four or five lengths and let him get quite a long way clear um hatch defender is in second now welsh rabbit down this near side is third then ithaca circle and foreign trade purple morning he's after that one the two out the back patterson's return and uh, niggle harry at the two james shane horses well they're used to be out being out the back anyway so i don't think they'll be too concerned but they're gonna have some traffic to get through if they're gonna play a part in the finish and it's pathmaster who's in the lead from ithaca circle purple morning they're coming through now here comes organized state who's now got himself a decent position only about four deep on the track humid rarity and foreign trader next in welsh rabbit missiles locked he's trying to get into it hatch defender patterson's return he's starting to weave his way through the Field on the inside, Niggle Harriet still the back marker with the unbeaten Monterey Cole struggling out the back at the moment, and it's Pathmaster with two and a half to go. Pathmaster then is still three clear of Human Rarity who's gone second then Missiles locked to Organised State Welsh Rabbit then comes Ithaca Circle and down on this near side Patterson's return has got nowhere to go and it's Pathmaster who's in the lead as they hit the furlong pole Pathmaster got himself into the lead and he kept away from all the trouble he's four clear inside the final furlong here comes Ithaca Circle who's now flying in second Pathmaster needs a line to come here comes Ithaca Circle and now Patterson's return's got a clear run and Patterson's return is flying and sweeps into the lead to take it Patterson return Niggle Harriet also finished really well to finish third and you've been watching the races this season you will have been waiting for those two James Shea horses to come flying through it looked like Patterson's return had been blocked off and wasn't going to get a run through but he made a found a way through and Patterson's return for James Shea this is turning into the James Shea show this Pathmaster second for Joshua Sutherland was second Niggle Harriet for James Shea again was third fourth was Purple Morning for Munas and fifth was Ithaca Circle for Vinnie Gerard. goodness knows what happened to Monterey cool never got anywhere near the race at all today but what has James Shea done to those horses the finishing kick he's got on some of his horses this season is absolutely incredible